Hi, I'm here NT, and I'm the guy that wrote Attribute Slider, a new add-on for the Concrete 5 Marketplace. You can see it here. Basically, it lets you do full rich text slides. It makes it really easy to edit everything. So when you're adding images manually here, you get a little button to edit your attributes. So you can edit the title, you get a full what you see is what you get text editor here. So you could even do secondary images or whatever you want in there. And then we've got a slide link as a custom attribute. So you can enter link text and manually enter the link or choose from the site map. Actually, I should probably add a few more images just to make sure that we've got all of them. I made several different templates for it. Uh, several of them are different color scheme variations on the same theme. So lobster right here. We have that in orange. Sorry. Or you can do dark gray. We have some for free up templates, the Diaz templates. Basically, Attribute Slider came about because we were getting lots of different designs at the website development shop that I work at and we needed a way to do these custom themed templates you can see here's one of them doesn't have any buttons or anything it's just one slide here's another one this one they have it set to just play through once we did some custom template here where it does even and odd as it loops and the image swaps or the text swaps from left to right. We did one here where it's got navigation over the top and then just a link, no text or anything, but just needed to have a quick, easy little slider. This one here is for a theme I'm developing for the Concrete 5 Marketplace using the fade animation instead of the slide animation. This one here, you can see we need to do two buttons, so that was pretty easy. We just have slide primary link and slide secondary link, since these are done with attributes. You as a developer can come over here to your file attributes, you can see here you have attribute slider options so if you want to add another text one you just have to choose attribute slider for the test because you know it already exists but now that we've added text field to our attribute when we come to edit our slider here 
we now have our new text field automatically added to the list. So you can see it makes it really easy to extend out into different, basically you can do almost anything once you start developing against this attribute slider. Um, this one here, we needed to be able to position the background image, so we did background position horizontal and background position vertical. So and see how our image moved there. So that's it. The name is Attribute Slider. I hope that you guys like it and that people end up coming back to it and using it on several different sites. I think it's really the library that it's built on is Caro Fred Cell, which allows you to do nearly anything for your slides. So if you look at what they do here, they've got responsive and fluid carousels that you can do so it automatically centers and for configuration if you want to make your own custom slideshows you can use their configuration robot here and basically almost generate out exactly the JavaScript you're going to need to do your custom carousel. Thanks for watching.